Georgetown just finished their season at 7-25. That is the worst in the Big East. In this video, I will be rebuilding them, trying to get them a championship. Here is the new coach of the Georgetown Hoyas, Chiquita Claps. He is really hoping to turn this program around. I'll be signing my contract right here. Started off the year right, beating Mount St. Mary's 80-62. But then we got destroyed by Northern Kentucky and Texas A&M Corpus Christi. We finally got a win against UTSA, but then we were back to getting destroyed by Oklahoma State, even Dartmouth. Kept simming games and we were just getting blown out. UMBC even did, decided to blow us out. Illinois State blew us out and we finally got a much needed win. But the more I simmed, the more we lost. I finally just decided to sim until conference play. Old Dominion beats us. And look at this, Nebraska beats us 47 to 104. It was another game. And another. And even another. Who even is that school that just beat us? Start conference play, we are 4 and 12. Despite our record, we are able to sign three-star Reg Hood and two-star Ben Howard. I finally decided to hop into a game for rivalry week to take on our rival St. John's. Started off the game with this mid-range jumper, taking early to a lead and then hit a three to go up five. St. John's came right down the court to hit a mid-range, cut the lead to four to five. Then they hit a three to go up nine to five. And how about another three to go up 12 to seven? We had a nice block and push it up the court, but we could not get it to go. St. John's was having everything easy as they found someone inside to go up 14-7. Found a wide open three, but just could not knock it down. We got a nice steal here, pushed it up the court, could not finish, but he got his offensive rebound and put it up and in. How about another steal? Pushed it all the way up the court and had an easy layup. Cut that lead to 14-11. Dumps it inside. Find number 11. Now it's only 14-13. to They came down the court, hit a mid-range. Three seconds to go. We push it up the court and hit a deep three at the buzzer to tie it up. St. John's drove in for an easy layup right there. Heath hit not only one three, but came off of this block, pushed it up the court, and hit another three. Almost stolen by St. John's, but we took it in for the easy two. A quick 8-0 run. Looked like a travel there, but St. John's puts it up and in. We came right back and had an easy life of our own. How about Murray with that acrobatic finish? They kept fouling, but we dumped it inside for the easy two. An insult to injury hit the three as we would win 25 to 37 against St. John's. I simmed the rest of our conference games. Lost to Providence, lost to Connecticut, and lost to Creighton. Get blown out by Marquette and Villanova. Another blowout loss to Providence. Blown out by Seton Hall. We ended up finishing last place in our conference at 1-12. St. John's one game ahead of us. They were our one win in conference play. We lost to DePaul in round one of the Big East tournament. Creighton ended up defeating UConn to win the Big East tournament. Not only did they win the Big East, they also won the national championship. Here we got our recruits, three-star Reg Hood, two-star Nathan Gaines, two-star Ben Howard, two-star Grant Williams, and two-star LeVar Copeland. We got some big freshmen here that could see some early playing time. And the big one, three-star 71 overall freshman Reg Hood. The question is, will this be enough to lead Georgetown to compete in the Big East in year two?